CrossFit is at the peak of its popularity across the United States, and that includes the Wiregrass. I think the biggest part of that is the community, uh, the community that you have with CrossFit. It's, it's unlike any other. CrossFit pushes you to limits that you never thought you could reach. And Dollar says despite popular belief, it is for everyone. You're working at your own relative intensity. It's not, uh, it's not about how fast this person or that person's going. Um, it's, it's how uh, effective you are uh, moving at your own relative intensity. So it's not based off of anyone else but you. So we're going to put that to the test. Now the main question for people is do they have what it takes to finish a CrossFit wad, a workout for the day? And I'm about to do this myself. So Brandon, let's get to it. Let's get to it. But before any good workout, you've got to stretch and do some warm ups. This is, this is just the warm up and I'm already feeling it right now. Whew. When the workout began, I thought I would breeze through it pretty easily. Boy, was I wrong. I worked out muscles that I didn't even know I had, struggling the whole way through it. I alternated through three sets and 10 repetitions of push press, toe to bar, and deadlifts. And at the end of the day, I can honestly say I got my workout in. And I just completed the CrossFit workout, and let me tell you people, it kicks your butt. I am wore out right now, as you can tell, I'm drenched in sweat, but you know, Brandon's gonna be the judge of it. Brandon, do you think I have what it takes you know, to, to make it here in CrossFit? Definitely has what it takes. Definitely has what it takes, 100%. All right, so see people, even people like me can come out here, get a good workout in, and have what it takes to make it through the entire workout. Brandon, thank you for letting me come Absolutely. out here today and give it a try. Yeah, but we're gonna toss it back to you in the studio.